I'm confused. This thing was forty dollars, by the way. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna be highly upset if it's. It's heavy. It is. It's heavy. Um. Mm -hmm. I don't feel a cheat sheet. So. Interesting. Alrighty then. Oh god, that's heavy. So, this is most likely going to be Japanese type snacks because it is Sanrio. Is this just like a regular flavor? So this is just the regular flavor, which kind of tastes like a Sprite. Yeah. It tastes like Sprite, basically, the regular ones. So, and I know my son will die when he sees this, so. I guess it's, mm -hmm. it says with marble. Maybe this is a strawberry? Yeah, a strawberry flavor thing. Okay. So, to so, me, strawberry. so this is just the regular one, which this and the strawberry will save for the boy, because he loves these things. Like and you have to chill them first, anyhow. I like them. I like the. They have um, a sangria one, <clears throat> and grape, and I think they're amazing. I mean, that's not bad because like right there, just those stupid sodas. Mm -hmm. Like if you go to like your market and get them, the cheapest place I found them is at a place. <laughs> And they are, at that place, they're almost $2 a piece. So right there, it's like $4 out of this thing. So. <laughs> We've had this before. It's just the, the onion. You want to try them anyway? Nice. They don't really give you a lot of chocolate, which is a bummer. Yeah. But you can't like take this out and see. But they like, I mean, the stick basically, it's not even as deep as that. And I've turned it around. No double dip. I didn't. I know. Basically, the same thing as the yin yang things. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh. That's just a strawberry one. Strawberry flavor. You'll probably eat that one later. Mm -hmm. I know. Might as well get rid of that all the way. No. no. You know what that is. David's gonna slap right into his mouth. I mean, basically, it's like the chocolate pie. Which means it's gonna be put them in there. Yes. Yes. It's basically chocolate pies. Chocolate pies with Hello Kitty. So they're gonna the be <clears throat> marshmallow, and I hate marshmallows. They're chocolate pies. They're chocolate pies. <laughs> this is something different. What? 
Happy with the food. Hello, Kitty. And I got a strawberry flavor. Mm hmm. Egg, gluten, milk, and soy. Just in case, I have a problem. So, okay, now the thing I'm finding, like you're seeing me look very confused, is I always thought this. Hello Kitty stuff and Sanrio was Japanese. Those chocolate pies, right on the back says they were made in Korea. This says made in Taiwan. Yeah, it's Sanrio. They have stuff all over the place. I thought it was Japanese though. <laughs> the very strong smelling of strawberry. There's mm. puffs. They're not that bad. They're actually kind of... At the end there, they kind of like... Dissipate. And just turns into a cookie. That's weird. It just uh -huh. dissipates on your tongue, but it's not terrible. It's not like one of those, ugh, strawberry. This box is hecka cute, too. Yeah, it is. Okay. Cute. Malaysia. <laughs> Malaysia, you don't open! This is it. She's gonna burst it and go everywhere. That's gonna be funny. Like, so far, mm -hmm. I'm really not seeing a $40 value in this box. Mm -hmm. Yeah, new. Mm -hmm. I don't know what this is, but it's green. It looks like a green one. Oh, is that gonna be Green bean. Is it actually a green bean? Yeah. yeah I wish I had like a write up. It doesn't it looks like a like a cheese pop. It's a green bean. We have these here too. These are food It just took like a cheese pop inside. Yes. Why don't I hit it? No, it doesn't. It tastes like those veggie straw chips. I think they got run over by the ramen and bottom. And, uh, <laughs> you know what panda tastes like? I have no idea what a panda tastes like. It's cookies! Dum dum. What in the world is mine? She said we know what panda tastes like. I'm like, no, no, no. What your panda tastes like? Uh, who wants a. It looks like a sugar cookie. Sugar cookie. That looks like a panda. That's pandas. Is there two of those in there? There's three different flavors. Scary. This one's strawberry. This one's chocolate. And this one's not quite strawberry. This one looks like maybe vanilla or lemon. Chocolate. Oh, it looks like cookies. 
Okay. Oh, the bunnies on the front. Chocolat. I like it. Mm-hmm. Is that chocolate one? No. Mm -mm. Hell no. You keep that one then. Yeah, sit here. Y'all can watch it and eat the whole fucking thing. It's like a butter cookie. <laughs> the faintest. I mean, this, there's a lot of chocolate in it. Mm -hmm. But it doesn't overpower it. And it's like butter cookies. Mm -hmm. This one? Might be vanilla or lemon inside. What? What? Like, uh, Hello, cream. Something of vanilla or lemon. Could be like a melon, yeah. No. Oh, bad. Sounds <laughs> <laughs> like vanilla. Lemon, you just have a strawberry? What is it, vanilla? Mm -hmm. No thanks. <laughs> wow, this was a nice buttery cookie, though. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No. I love these. We've had these before, but guess what? You can watch us eat them. I'm not seeing forty dollar value in this box. The box, like I said, is super cute, though. I bet you if you brought this box to, to work, they would actually take the box as well. Maybe. You know what? Looking at this, that's probably kind of cool. But we're just going to do that thing right now. Yeah. We're going to see. Can I see it? While you try that? Hi. Oh, I Sour paper candy cola. Okay. I just want to know what it was. Mm. Was the last two things? Mm -hmm. That is a weird aftertaste. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Rice cakes. Let me see that box back. I mean, is it me? Does it kind of give up a weird, funky, like, matcha vibe at the end? Mm -hmm. I don't think I like that. Yeah. Kind of has a matcha thing going on. So, we've had the rice crackers before. In a box. But this has, like, a strawberry flavoring on it. And I find that they're crunchy, but they're salty. So we'll see. Salty. Strawberry's not disgusting. And the cracker's not super salty. Because the last ones we had were. Yeah. And they're in packages of two. Until we get eight packages. Alright. So. You know how if you go on, like, the I'm gonna be a boring person diet and you get rice cakes? <laughs> this is what it tastes like. Like a rice cake. Very little strawberry put on it. 
I think it kind of tastes more like the popcorn ones, though. Yeah. This is good. Those are good. And let me tell you, I hate strawberry. This is not worth 40 bucks. 100% not worth 40 bucks. Mm. Not for nothing. These are really good. I think these are stain. I hate roast cakes, by the way. Mm. But this is good. Someone says it's a roast cracker. Mm, that was good. It's not worth 40 bucks. It's not worth forty dollars at all. Let's look like inside. Ooh. <laughs> it's super light. It's super light. Uh oh. What? I think it's my favorite out of the box. Oh. Mm-hmm. What? Mm -hmm. Yep. So, apparently, only California knows that you can get cancer from something in this product. That's all I can taste is the aftertaste kind of has a peanut aftertaste, but it could be just peanut oil, which is going to mess up my stomach. Hopefully not, but... So... My favorite thing, I like that a lot. I like those crackers too, the rice crackers. Um, that had a weird aftertaste, like it, like, like it was like hanging out with matcha, and matcha's evil. The box is hella cute though. It is really cute. I think we're going to fill that box up. And with the stuff that we don't. Because there's a lot of stuff. Like, we still have, like, boxes over there. Snacks. So we need to just fill that up for the stuff that we did. We probably should put the stuff we want to keep in this one because it's really cute. And then we'll put the stuff to get rid of in another box. Yeah. David loves those. You like those. David still, I don't think, has really eaten the other ones. Does he? Mm -hmm. Well, now he's got more. Yeah, but that's in a facility, so it's fine. I like those rice crackers. What is in there? In the rice cracker bag? There's, there was eight of them, there's seven more. Oh, what is it, stickers? Yes, it is. Don't Not eat it. Eat. Which means that some fool ate it at some point when, ooh, an extra treat. More. Because sometimes, like, if you buy a purse, there's one in there, and apparently somebody at some point in time thought it was a snack and was dumb enough to just be like, I'm going to eat it. That is why we have warning tags on things. Because people are, just in general, stupid. Like, come on, don't iron pants with like, iron while you're wearing them. 
lot more room for it. My problem, my biggest problem with things like that is the tags that say don't use near water. If something's plugged in, of course you don't use it in or near water. But it really somebody takes somebody to be dumb enough to be in the tub saying, I would like some toast, but I would not like to get out of the tub. And the toaster falls in and they get zapped. It takes someone thinking they found an extra snack to tell them not to eat the desiccants. A desiccant keeps things dry. That's why you go to a fast food joint and you ask for a coffee. It has to tell you that the contents in the cup are hot. It's like, duh. So, yeah, I mean, really, if you find... But that was a kind of different situation. Though, that situation if you find a treat though. bag, it's Don't not a treat me. bag. That is not a gummy. This is really a cool desiccant, though. It, it, the desiccant just keeps whatever it is dry. So if you find them in, like, shoes or a purse, it's because to keep the inside dry. Mm -hmm. Until you purchase it. Because moisture in the air gets into stuff like that. But why would you have that in the to keep the rice crackers from getting all moist. Especially in shipping or I'm whatever. I'm putting it back in the box. Excuse me. Because that's going to make the box all messy. Just call me Gaseous Clay. Okay, Gaseous. <laughs> well, that's it for this box. Rice crackers. They are good. Surprisingly. And that weird wafery thing at the end. Those two were my favorite. Still not worth $40. Not even with utility. The box is hella cute. Even at the most expensive store, these are two change. So let's say the $3. That's only 6 bucks. So maybe it does come out to the 40 But oh I don't think it was worth it. Although, Dave will love those. He loves those kind of drinks. Loves so them. the original and that strawberry. Mm -hmm. And they got Hello Kitty on them. Come on. They're super cute. And you know if these were purchased out of store in America, they will add money to the price because Hello Kitty is on it. Like I was saying, the ones that I found at the other store, mm -hmm. depending on where you go, one of the stores that we went to they're like a dollar ninety-five or something, mm -hmm. and then the market, they're like almost three dollars. And yeah, do you think the marbles are different? Probably not. There's actually people that collect the marbles that get dropped into this. They usually just clear marbles, but I know he's gonna love this. These are like the coolest thing. And, alright, so. The thing, like, if you read up on Bamane, it's not a flavor. Which is weird to me. Because if you actually read it, it Bamane refers to the way it's packaged. Is it place? It refers to how it's packaged. We didn't know there's a price on it. Please do not swallow the open. Do not allow small children to open the bottle of the Do not try to remove the marble from the bottle to allow any injury. Do not freeze or thaw the direct sunlight touch or a story will disappear to some extent inside. Do not consume if top marble is open, wrapped, or contained. I think they're cool though. But yeah, I so the on the if you look it up, Ramane refers to the way it's sealed, not flavoring. Which I think was very interesting because like the when it oh, when you get the original one like that 
Usually it says original, and it's kind of got like a Sprite flavor. But my son loves these, especially the grape ones. So you'll end up with these after they're nice and refrigerated. My favorite is still that weird chocolate bar thing. Like, kind of that wafer -y thing. Yeah, it's probably going to cause me stomach problems, but... Am I not? Well, all I did, uh, like, instantly, Lee was like, oh no, I taste peanut. But, I like those... Those well, rice... rice cakes See, I usually hate rice crackers, because they're so salty. But that one, first off, it wasn't salty. Because, mm -mm. like, last time we tried rice crackers, the second the bottom of that cracker touched my tongue, I'm like, oh, it's going to be so salty. But that, and I hate strawberry especially fake strawberry flavoring but, but that's really but this, this good box, any other two boxes that we normally get if you get stuff that's flavored it actually tastes mostly what it's supposed to be like grapes taste like grapes and strawberries taste like strawberries things like that which i don't know because i don't fruit look at me do i look like i eat fruit you look like banana mean you don't like fruit please i do not like fruit i do not like vegetables mm. i am fat because i'm a carboholic and everything i eat is basically yellow Probably. white no it's because what i eat is yellow or white white rice white potatoes and that's where you get more carbs than you ever need bread bread I love bread the sugar in those rice cakes? Where? Like, for me, my usual sugar intake is these snack boxes. Yeah. Because I find that... I find that... Just straight up, like, potato chips and candy is, like, not even... Like, I can get a pack of Twizzlers... Mm. And slam a pack, a big pack of Twizzlers in a week. What? Hey, David. Mm. You want some soda? Yeah. Come get it. I'm gonna bring. I'll bring it in there in a second. Hold on. All right, it's breakable. But yeah, so I'm a carbohol. I hate sweet potato. Hate. I tried sweet potato fries. Like, I like boiled potato, where you put a little tiny bit of sprinkling of salt and just a tiny bit of butter on it, and it's delicious. But we tried that with sweet potato, and I'm like, uh, you're trying to murder me. Mm -hmm. Um, even like my... So here, my, my foods fall into very tan. I like bread, which is horrible for you. I like white rice. White potato. Um, what else? Like, if you look at my plate, you're gonna be like, are we in like a black and white movie? Because it's like chicken, turkey, but there's no color to that. I like pizza, but there's also no color to that unless you count the sauce. So. Because I only get pepperoni depending on where we go. There's... Alright, I think I found a bunny trail. I know. I know. Red meat isn't really a thing. I do once in a while. So if you want to send us, like, a burger in one of these boxes, it'd be kind of nasty by the time it gets here. But that would be cool. No. Like, because all the different... Like, all the different types of potato chips we've tried from these boxes... Mm -hmm. We tried, like, that other one, like I said, legit tasted like a, a bakery pizza with just the sauce. I wonder if they would try, like, making, like, a burger, because they've tried loaded potato, all kinds of stuff. Like a burger? What about, like, a burger-flavored chip? That'd be definitely interesting. Mm -hmm. Huh. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Not worth forty dollars. No. New packaging. A lot of the snacks are really good. 
I mean, that I'm... chocolate, those chocolate stick things were very odd because for some reason I got a matcha aftertaste and I don't like that. But when I think sangria, I think of the family having keychain. Now, it would have been cool if there was like a little keychain or something in here. Even if it just said Sanrio or something. But, like I said, no, I don't think it's worth it. Monetarily, it probably most definitely is. But, if I had known that that's what it was, I probably would not have purchased it. But, now you know. So you don't make that same mistake if this is not stuff that you want. I will say, compared to another box that we do... Mm -hmm. It's just a tiny bit more expensive than the other Japanese mm -hmm. snacks. It did have some really nice stuff in it, though. Yeah. I'm going to totally smash those rice crackers. They probably won't make it until next, let's say, Monday. Mm -hmm. They won't make it till next Monday. Because nope. those are really good. That's great, too, because I don't like to eat a lot during the day. Like, that would be perfect, because those, they yeah. they will fill you up. Oh, yeah. So. Cute box. Not worth the price. Not really worth the money at all. Not to us, anyways. My cat's checking out the box. He's like, I'm gonna snatch. Witches. Okay. All right, ladies and gentlemen. So, we still have two boxes that we actually ordered coming in and I may be ordering another box he's staying just enough off to the side where you can't see his cute little face hey look come here anything for food this one. Oh, what did it smell like is that dutchy Yeah, not worth it. I'm not going to touch him too much because then he'll attack me on camera and then we'll have proof that he's a turd. He's just smelling one of the sticks from the... Yeah, he doesn't care. He doesn't care. He's he's mad that we're using his, his little footstool thing there. We call it a hassock. Depending on where you're from. We're the northeast of the United States. We call it a hassock. Covered in cat hair. So. so yeah, we're using his little hassock. I sometimes say footstool so people know what I'm talking about. But yeah, no, not worth it. Um, no. probably would have been nice. I probably would have thought it'd be more worth it if there was either a little stuffed thing or a keychain. Mm -hmm. Or something in there. But, yeah, I mean, is what it is. There's the cat. His cute little face. From the video? He doesn't care. He's like, y'all stupid. And now we got stuff in his cat tree. So now he's even doubly ticked off. So, <laughs> alright. Until we get the one of the next two boxes, which should be coming in anytime. So hopefully, if there's any chocolate, it we catch it before the mailman leaves. So it's not she was cool though cool. today. She knocked. She knows I look for my boxes. So, thankfully, she knocked because there's somebody stealing stuff on the street. We know. We saw you. All right. Adios, time. Got you. Say bye bye. Rotten cat. He's not rotten. He thinks he's a pirate. You think you're a pirate? Huh? The Dutch thinks he's a pirate. You know how big that damn cat is? Look at him. And he's gonna sit on her shoulder. He's a parrot! Because he's a goober. No. Give us a like if you like my kitty. That pirate. He's getting agitated, his tail's flipping. Alright, ready? Till the next one. Adios. Bye bye. Bye.